it's giving Kamala <laughs> after she got her weekly silk press like that's what it's giving what's up court crew and welcome back to the channel it's your girl Courtney Janine and I'm back with another video today's video is another synthetic wig install I'm super excited because we are going to be reviewing together the new Outre Sucre collection unit in the style Aura this is one of the new Sucre that are like a medium length it's a totally different style that I've never seen before with this collection so I'm super excited to be reviewing it for you guys if this is your first time seeing me here on the YFT hey girl hey my name is Courtney Janine I do beauty fashion and lifestyle content here on this channel so definitely subscribe join the core crew family down below and let's get into today's video all right you guys so if you have not seen this wig no worries but but girl are you tapped into my let's talk new synthetic wig releases that's where I give you all the tea on the upcoming unit so you guys can just have a better scope of what's coming out this month so you can better budget plan for the synthetic wigs that you feel are worth your money so definitely check out those videos but this is what the unit looks like she's 14 inches on the site it says wavy but from the stock card and just the overall look of this unit I feel like it is going to definitely be a yakky texture but we'll see when we open it up so let's go ahead and do that all right y'all so I have reviewed a sleek lay part um I reviewed Emery pretty recently so if you haven't seen that video definitely check it out that is such a beautiful unit but anyways the sleek lay part collection is a more hand tied lace near the part creates a sleek flat look get a humpless laid finish with no heat styling required the key features are wider hand tied lace parting deep c shape side parting which helps for it to look even more natural because with side parts especially you want like a curved part instead of just straight back because it just looks even more natural extra hand tied lace edges humpless laid finish pre-plucked hairline natural baby hairs and heat friendly so i picked it up in the color dr chocolate squirrel i just have not reviewed a unit in that color in mad long so it, it's been time um but it also comes in sandy blonde golden amber black cherry honey brown cinnamon spice and ginger copper so if you would like to see those colors then definitely check out my channel I have reviewed quite a few of those colors before so you can at least see what that color blend looks like on my skin tone even if it's not this specific unit you can see it in another unit but still the same color all right you guys I feel like that's a great overview so let's go ahead and unbox this and talk about the cap construction you guys so this is the color straight of the pack uh, you guys I love chocolate swirl because it is such a beginner friendly color like if you are scared to try a blonde or more browns this is just like the perfect gateway color because it it's likely given chocolate brown but it's still super pretty it's, this is what the unit looks like straight out the pack um to give you all a update on the texture it definitely is not yakky it feels very soft to the touch as if it's a silky unit but i do feel a little bit of like texture to it i hope that makes sense but i don't think it's yakky and i don't think it's silky either it's a great medium but more so on the silky side it just has a um high density if that makes sense parting is on the left side it's pretty standard a comb in the back and adjustable strap and then a comb on each side of the part this is what it looks like inside all right you guys i am super excited to try this on so let's go ahead and switch wigs i always get questions about this headband unit and honestly guys i don't know what headband unit it is so just scroll back on my channel and if you see a similar texture then this is what it is i just cut it a little bit shorter to my shoulder so that it just looks a little bit more natural but yeah y'all i just be throwing this one on but i'm gonna um try this on and we'll see what it looks like all right court crew so this is the wig straight out the pack nothing to it okay i have some thoughts this unit really reminds me of outre melted hairline sabrina it is such a natural length i got it in a natural color i think that right now just based off of what it's given right now it's given michelle obama it's given first lady it's given madam president i don't know it's given kamala after she got her weekly silk press like that's what it's giving i don't know if i like it i don't hate it but i don't like like it either but this is definitely different um which is what i like a lot of the recent units have been super repetitive and even though this might not be like my go-to style it's different for the sleek collection so 
you know, I like that. Pre-pluckedness, it could be plucked a little bit more and I probably will just pluck a little bit right here and right here just so that it's giving as natural as possible but I really like the color. Those are kind of my initial thoughts. It definitely is giving every day. I feel like this is a unit that won't really tangle as much just because it's so natural looking. Um, so yeah, I'm excited about this unit. I think that it's, I don't know, I feel like this should have came out during the summer maybe um, just because it's a more natural length um, but it also is giving silk press season. So I can kind of see it both ways but I'm going to give you guys a full 360 and then I'm going to go do my makeup and then come back to install this unit but let me know your thoughts on this unit down in the comments below because yeah it's giving me Sabrina which you know I'm not mad at. I'm also really glad that I got a natural color. I feel like in a two or one it would have looked even more natural but like the chocolate swirl this subtle brown is really really pretty but yeah you guys i'm gonna give you guys a full 360 and then i'll be back to give you all the install and my final thoughts so here's the hair all to the front Outre Sleek Lay Part in this style Aura. Again, I picked this up in the color Chocolate Swirl. So let's go ahead and get into my pros, cons, and final thoughts on this unit. Before we get into the pros and cons, I just want to briefly go over the key features. Wider hand tie lace part. I did pluck the parting a little bit. I don't think you actually needed to, but the thing is about this unit is that the knots are really black. So just plucking out some of those hairs did help with just making the part a little bit more seamless deep c shape side parting love that aspect of this unit and all of the sleek lay part side part styles because they always come with the c shape parting which just makes it look even more natural helpless lay finish i did go in with a little bit of a little bit of heat but i do think that it came pretty flat pre-plugged hairline no i did have to pluck this unit um myself natural baby hairs yes i did swoop a little bit today and heat friendly of course i did use some heat today so that is true and again i picked it up in dr chocolate swirl but it comes in a number of specialty colors all right y'all let's get into my pros cons and final thoughts so um my first con is the black knots the knots are very dark on this unit is a bummer just because if the knots were a little bit more if they were lighter it just would have been an all-around like better unit in terms of another con this is like a preference thing but just looking at the stock card i really thought this was going to be giving yakky texture even though i did look on the site and it did say that it was a wavy style i just was like that's not true like i knew that when i got the unit it would probably look yakky and no it is not yakky at all which i was extremely saddened by i just feel like this unit would have been even more natural if it did have a bit of yakiness to it and like i mentioned before i could tell that it has a little bit of like weight to it but it's not it's not yakky though like it's still silky like even as you can see like i can just like 
mold it myself and that's because it has a lot of density so you can kind of like play with it and like just mold the hair however you want but I do think that if it was yakky it would just be giving a if it was yakky it would just be giving like a blowout style which um I would prefer also I just feel like you can also this is preference but you can definitely like straighten this out I just feel like that would look so much better than just like hugging my neck so that's like a style thing um, but I think that the overall style of the unit is cute. Alright, let's get into my pros. So my pros, I definitely like how this unit is kind of like branching out for the Sleek Lake collection. The only other mid-length bob um, unit is called Nella, which I have in my possession. I just haven't reviewed yet. Heard a lot of good things, so I definitely think that that is going to be such a hit when I finally try her. But this is like one of the very few mid-length natural style units. A lot of the Sleek Lake are longer um more flowy and i feel like this was just a, a breath of fresh air so i really do like the overall style of it i think it looks super duper natural it reminds me of outre melted hairline sabrina a lot just in a sleek lay part a bit more like density to it which i actually really do like as well i love the color this is chocolate swirl i haven't done a dark color in what seems like a minute um but i always love this color and i feel like it's just it's a great gateway a special color um to try it first and then to ease your way into the more ginger havana browns um and more blonde colors so definitely love this color love the overall style you guys know i love a good um side part unit i think it's super natural it's perfect every day didn't experience any shedding didn't experience any tangling i think that will come with wear but as of now I think it's great that I haven't experienced any of it. Overall, I think that this is a perfect everyday unit. I think she's perfect for the office, perfect for those types of vibes. Um, she is giving first lady on me. Completely honest, she is giving Michelle Obama. She's giving Kamala Harris, Madam President. Like, that's what she's giving. She's giving Olivia Pope. Like, I don't know how else to describe it, but that's what she's giving to me. Let me know your thoughts on this unit down in the comments. Let me know if you picked her up. Oh, let's talk about price because I did pick this up on my own so you know whenever I talk about pricing that means I picked it up <laughs> myself this unit I was actually surprised because if you don't know a lot of new sleek lay units came out if you don't know that outro came out with a number of new sleek lay then you probably are not tuned into my let's talk new synthetic wig releases and that's fine girl but you need to be tuned into the tea coming out with a lot of new sleek lay units and I was surprised by the pricing of these the aura unit it, the one that I have on is $42.94. This isn't even um, including the specialty color. If you want a specialty color, it's going to add on two more dollars. Um, but other units such as Analia, which is a longer sleek lay unit, it is going for $40.94. So I just don't understand why a 14 inch sleek lay part unit is going for $42, while a sleek lay part longer unit is going for $40.94. I don't get that in my head. I don't know what the thought process was from Outre on that, but that's the only thing I wanted to point out because I was actually really surprised when I looked at the pricing. I don't think that $42 is a bad price point for the sleek leg because you are getting a more like beginner friendly unit. You don't have to do much to this unit, but I do see that's weird that I thought that I thought that with synthetic wigs we're paying for the color we're paying for the um, length of the unit we're paying for the quality of the lace and if it's the same collection but one is longer why is the one that's longer less money than the one that's shorter I don't really know um also if you are looking to pick up Shadora um I think she was 44 which is even more yeah Shadora is 44.94 so that's four more dollars than a unit that's longer than her um so I just feel like that's very weird I did not pick up um Shadora I might pick her up Shadora does look like Anisha so I see the repetitiveness that people might say but this was kind of like a new style so I did want to do this one let me know if you want to see Shadora um, in the comments I might pick her up I might not I have a lot of new units that I want to try so I'm trying to you know spread the love between different units while also doing with Tober like there's so much going on so yeah just let me know in the comments what you would like to see next because I'm planning a new with Tober video as well but yeah you guys those are kind of like my final thoughts the biggest thing for me is the pricing with this unit I think it's really weird that it's more expensive than a longer sleek leg part unit it. Um, but other than that, I think she's cute. 
I think she's perfect for every day. I think she would have been perfect in the summertime because it really is giving just that everyday sort of vibe. But I definitely think that this color is perfect for fall. Let me know your thoughts on this unit down in the comments below. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, don't forget to give it a big thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe and join the Core Crew family down below. We're so close to, we're like halfway to 13K, which is insane. Um, so definitely subscribe, tell a friend to tell a friend. And your girl will see y'all in the next one. Bye, guys. Thank you.